every time he says something, he gets in deeper. And he gets he keeps getting in deeper. But we think a lot of you, Ken. We hate to see you.
quite an impression on Miss Crosby. Gilbert thought he'd throw this away for nobody could find it, but we retrieved it because we know we're going to get this very late. One other little thing here, Miss Crosby, to make sure that he got. This is a bottle of suntan lotion. We know Cook's going to be sitting outside his pool, you know, in his retirement. He's going to have his phone out there. He's taking into consideration how hot it is and how much he talks. This is some suntan lotion so his tongue won't get sunburned. <laughs> Not least, you know, when you work around a lot of people for a long time, they do funny things. And uh, so this, this is what happened with a bunch of us. Uh, when something funny happened, uh, it wanted a cartoon. And uh, somebody in the office, uh, I don't know who the artist was, I think it was about 90% of them. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Taylor has a, is going to finish up for us, Cook, then probably you'll get a chance to say a few words. Uh, Lord, with the permission of your wives, we will let you go to Florida, okay? Kitty wife. Not for government, but for your business. I can handle that. Okay? You'll affect him through January. Just with faith? Without faith. <laughs> You know, Cook will come to work for us in MMQ uh, 17 years ago, and I dare say that he would not even have imagined that he was going to be retired today. I have on good word that he says that every year he's been saying that he's going to retire. This is the year I'm going to retire. And it took him 17 tries to get to that point, but now he's apparently made it. There's one thing we can say for Cooper. And, and it's a really a good thing. Cooper has always been adamant and a champion for quality. It didn't matter what it was. If it wasn't quality, he didn't want it. He was on one side, and the contractor's always been on the other. And he never got on the fence. There's a lot of us that gets on the fence. Cooper ain't got on the fence yet. He's always been on one side, and you knew where he was. He, he wasn't different. And I'll tell you, that's a fantastic thing. He didn't care. He's always been there. We, uh, we're going to miss you. Yeah. We're really going to miss you. 17 years in the same organization for a long time. You've been in for 17 years. It's going to be great. we got a few things that we want to give you. We've got a gift right here. I don't want to open that up. Yeah. I'm going to jump out and get this uh, envelope they send you through the mail, it looks like a plain envelope with a piece of mail in it, and when you open it up and it, it explodes, well now a little thing like that can explode and kill half a dozen people, what does you think about a big one like this? It's no fun to sit there and try to undo it. This. I don't know. Is this Elmer's doing? I don't know about that. Elmer, did you do this? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice. We'll have to cut away from it. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to keep it hidden. <laughs> John, did you do this? <laughs> I thought this was a pipe stand. <laughs>
When you take the pipe stand and reverse it, then you find out what it really is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who did this? We're not done. Y'all don't want to see this. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 